Hi there and good morning. This trap in the deferred Steinitz variation of the Spanish is called Dobrov Circumventing the Ark and it's from the game Dobrov against Silivanov, St. Petersburg 2004. So e4 and e5, knight f3, knight c6, bishop b5, the Spanish. Instead of the immediate Steinitz defense with d6, first a6 sends the bishop back to a4. And now d6, the deferred Steinitz. Well, in this very common position, white can play c3, can castle, can actually capture now uh, a deferred exchange variation, capturing the knight on c6, or play the immediate d4. Well, that pawn wants to head for d5, so black plays b5, sending the bishop back to b3. And now knight takes on uh, d4, Common move played by Short, Hubner, Spassky, Melaniuk. And white trades, knight takes. This is the Noah's Ark trap because if now e takes on d4, white dare not capture the pawn with queen takes on d4 because then he falls into the very well-known Noah's Ark trap where the c pawn is going to march forward, gaining time by hitting the queen and will get to c4 trapping in that bishop winning for black so white circumvents the arc circumvents the noah's arc trap as uh, dobrov played himself in his game against silivanov st petersburg 2004 by playing c3 now striking at the center so black's going to be a pawn up but white's going to have some counter play d takes on c3 White could play queen d5 here, but this might be a drawing line. Queen d5 immediately hitting f7, threatening mate, as well as the rook on a8. But we might see a draw after bishop e6. Everything's defended, the queen defending the rook on a8. And queen c6 check, the bishop drops back to d7. And a repetition of moves, queen d5, bishop e6, queen c6. So instead of uh, queen d5... White will play knight takes on c3. Now after knight f6, white can strike with e5. And this is a key position of this trap. Black's actually doing well here, probably slightly better, with d takes on e5. Allowing the bishop to try and exploit this overworked king with the move bishop takes f7. Which would usually be good for white. But here black does okay by king e7. And... Um, White really doesn't have too much to show. So, e5 should have been met by d takes e5, the most natural, but understandable why black would want to avoid this. So, if black plays knight g4, then it's black who's busted. White is winning now with queen to f3. Same type of idea, hitting f7 with the rook on a8, also targeted bishop e6. Keeps everything defended, but now that knight is looking a little bit loose on g4. After bishop takes on e6, black cannot recapture with the f pawn because then the knight is dropping. So, an in-between move by black, knight takes on e5, hitting the queen. But bishop takes f7, forces the knight to recapture. And now queen c6, check. If the black queen intervenes, then the rook is dropping, so king to e7 is met by knight d5 check forcing king e6 and knight takes on c7 is winning for white so this has been the dobrov circumventing the arc trap in the deferred steinitz of the spanish thanks for watching bye bye